In 2009, a 27-year-old Florida woman told authorities that she'd paid for a 10-piece order of chicken McNuggets, but was informed that they were out of McNuggets. According to a cashier, they offered the woman a larger portion of a different item for the same price. But the woman said that she didn't want the item they offered and instead asked for a full refund. She said they refused to refund her money and told her that all sales were final. That's when the woman decided to call 911. In fact, she called three times. Each time she was told an officer was en route. Just listen to a couple of those calls. 911, do you need police, fire, and ambulance? Police. Where? Okay, it's a McDonald's on um, Delaware. What's going on there? I ordered a um, 10 piece chicken nugget with a small fry, and mm -hmm. she said that they didn't have any chicken nuggets. And so I told her I want a um, McDonald's and a small fry. And she told me I won't have to pick anything else off the menu because she can't refund me um, the different thing out of the meal. And I told her to just give me all my money back. And she said when she can't give me my money back either, she will have to, I have to pick something. There's no manager there? Ma'am. You already spoke with the manager? She says she are the manager. She's saying something about she just can't refund me my money or something. But she don't have on the menu what I want. I want a chicken nugget. And so she didn't have that. So I told her to give me a McDouble and just to find the difference. And mm -hmm. she says she can't do that. So I told her to just give me all my money back. And I don't want anything. And she's telling me she can't refund my money now. She don't have what I want. And she can't force me to eat something that I don't want. 911, do you need police fire rescue? Calling you. How can I help you? I'm calling. Um, I'm the officer from McDonald's on US 1 or US 1 by the bridge. Okay, what's going on there? I just ordered for food. The manager just took my money and won't give me my money back. They're trying to make me get something off of me that I don't want. I ordered chicken nuggets. They don't have chicken nuggets. And so I told her to respond, give me my, just give me my money back. And she's telling me I have to pick something other than um, something else off of me. And she's not going to give me my money back. And she don't have the right to take my money. Click on my officer right here. Okay, I'm just... What the poor woman didn't realize was that the police were not coming to help her. They were issuing her a citation to appear in court for abusing 911. She reportedly told officers, This was an emergency, my McNuggets are an emergency. She was later interviewed by reporters and had this to say about the incident. And if I would have handled matters in my own hand, then I would have been in trouble, which I wanted to handle matters in my own hand. What did and you want so, to do? <laughs> and I wanted to jump across that counter, but I understand it's not her fault. She's just doing her job. And but so that's why I was young. You. She wouldn't give my money back. That's why I was a young, uh, young lady and called the police. Interestingly, McDonald's said in a statement that when an order cannot be filled, a customer should receive a refund. They regret that this did not happen in this case. They also sent her a gift card for a free meal.